My name's Callum Preston. I'm an artist from Melbourne, Australia. I've had a lot of different jobs, which has led me to here. This is The Shack. It's my studio, design office, workshop, and it's where I do my job day to day. I'm inviting talented people to come in and chat about all things work and jobs and to perform just for you, live here in my studio. This is The Shack Sessions. Today on The Shack, the men zingers. Greg. Hey. How are you doing? How's it going? Tom. Yeah. How are you? Good. Thank you for coming in. What were your very first jobs that you ever had? I was a dishwasher. Yeah. I rollerbladed into a catering place and was like, hey, it's my 14th birthday kind of job. I said, yeah, sure. <laughs> <laughs> a rollerblade entry. That's a, yeah, bold, that's a bold boot. Right? I think that maybe that's what got me the job. I worked at an amusement park and I did the go-karts. Oh, man. Uh, that's... It was kind of the best thing ever. Yeah, actually. that's amazing. Pretty, yeah. Um, so when, you know, the, when the park would shut down around five, we would just ride the go-karts all night. <laughs> that's an amazing job for uh, all your friends too, I assume. Oh, totally. Yeah, everybody got to come for free. And there was also like paintball there, so... It was like paintball go-karts. What do you think the worst job that you ever had is? Oh, man. Door-to-door home improvement sales during the uh, housing market crisis in the United States. That's probably the worst job. That's grim. That was hands down the worst job I ever had. Yeah. Yeah, so you'd knock on somebody's door, look at something that's wrong with their house, and be like, hey, we're doing a special on uh, gutters. Now I have $9,000 in credit card debt. I'm not paying $1,000 to fix my gutters and like slam the door and then... You yeah. walk to the next house. What about you? Um, I uh, delivered prescription medicine in Scranton. There was times where it was really fun. And it was one of those things too, is like, you know, it snows a lot in Scranton. And so yeah. um, there'd be a snowstorm and they're like, yeah, you have to go. Uh, you know, being 18, 19, I don't even know how old I was when I was doing it. Basically, you know, risking my life for like $5 an hour. Wow, on paper, you, your career sounds really shady. Like you were a uh, carny yeah. and then you're a drug dealer. <laughs> yep, yeah, yeah. My, my resume is just a complete joke at yeah. this point. And then a musician <laughs> for 10 years or eight years or whatever, yeah, so. Yeah. Uh, Nowadays, getting jobs is usually online or there's some sort of application or there'll be Facebook searching you. As a teenager, obviously you guys kind of fell into those jobs, but nowadays you'd have to email. What was your very first email address? Oh, that's, it was, uh, <laughs> it was actually kickflip 185. I, I couldn't get the 180, obviously. Nice. So 185 degrees, I guess, a little bit <laughs> off. Uh, Mine was uh, LandoC13 at AOL.com. Because okay. I really liked Lando Calrissian from Star Wars. <laughs> and I was 12, but I wanted everyone to think I was 13. Because it would be cool to be a teenager. So they made uh, Lando C13. It's just the weirdest. Everyone had, like anyone our age has that thing where those emails that they sign up for there's such a reason behind them like yeah. that like my first yeah. email address was no effects 200 <laughs> oh, nice. and yeah. i don't remember i'm sure i couldn't get just no effects but i don't know if i tried any numbers tried up to 200 <laughs> is there a job you know a dream job or a dream career that you've never taken a single step towards trying to achieve astronaut yeah yeah so shoot shoot high for that yeah. one <laughs> Uh, my, my grandfather was a firefighter, and cool. I always thought it was so cool growing up, yeah. but I'm petrified of fire. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Thanks for having us over. 
Most nights we always fall asleep with With something dumb on Netflix Some nights trash reality Or kids' cartoons Or shit in documentaries Not perfect but we're good together Yeah, me, you and our bad tattoos Yeah, all our stick and books All our inside jokes We'll regret them when we're dead and sober but we're still breathing, the party ain't over. You said LA is on two days with a job straight. Ten degrees out, I said it didn't mind stopping girls as long as we got out of the Midwest states. You said LA is on two days with a job straight. Ten degrees out, I said it Western States The Western States